Hello everyone. Welcome back to data wave interview question series. As part of this video, we are going to solve the given use case. See what is the use case? Okay. So here we need to print seventh table. Okay. So how we need to print? It's like seven one just seven, seven two just fourteen, seven three just twenty one up to seven ten just seventy. So in order to solve this problem, first you need to understand how to print the numbers. Okay, how to print the numbers from one to ten. This is very important. If you know how to print the numbers from one to ten, then it's very easy to build our use case. Okay, so seven is the given number. Okay, so this multiplication or x, okay, this is constant and equal to is constant. Now, what we need to do? This is number and this is the value, okay, suppose n into i, okay, you know how to multiply with two numbers, but here we need to frame the, we need to frame all the strings and numbers, so that is very important. Let's try to solve this problem. Go to data wave playground. Okay. So first we'll try to print the numbers. Okay. Where I equal to one to 10. Just observe here. If you print I, see what is happening. Okay. The numbers are printing now. You need to iterate, okay, or repeat one by one, and you have to frame the sentence like this: seven one just seven. Okay, how to do this one? It's very simple. Now, I map, okay, map of. So before this, the what is the given number? number equal to seven we need to print seventh table right okay you need to print seventh table just try to see now i map of dollar the dollar means so it will iterate one by one and it will print now what is the constant value here seven and multiplication symbol so before this before this just to print number, number, okay, space, plus, plus. So how it is coming? 71, 72, 73. But here in between we need a symbol, multiplication symbol. Okay, here I'm going to use X, X over here. So this is called concatenation. Seven plus plus x plus plus dollar seven one job okay now now what you need to do you need to print equal to okay either you want to keep one equal to or double equal to so that is up to you okay just you can keep it like this i'm going to keep only one equal to here okay seven one just equal to okay fine here what you need to do you need to multiply correct number into dollar okay number into dollar now you can see now you can see the beauty of this okay seven one jar seven 7 to 14, 7 3 21, up to 7 10 70. So if you want spaces, you can adjust this. Okay. Yeah, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching this. I'll come up with another interview question. Stay tuned. Happy learning.